The first thing you're going to want to do is get completely naked and then put some clamps on your nipples. Then you're going to want to get out your Ed Hardy bag full of colored pencils. Organize the pencils in such a way so as to make your coloring a lot easier. Once you've selected out a number of color pencils that you're going to use, you're going to want to sharpen all of them. Sharpen them all to the finest razor's point edge you can. And if your hand gets tired, just try to remember that your mom pushed you out of her womb and she didn't get tired when she was doing that. There. Now that you've got all your pencils sharpened, you're ready to start making the card. The first thing you want to do when you make the card is fold the paper in half. Your mom will be super impressed that you can actually do this. Now that you've got the card folded in half, what you want to do is write a good message on the card. I suggest something along the theme of Happy Mother's Day. Then you want to draw something on the card that maybe has nothing to do with your mom, but you want to draw something because if you just write Happy Mother, it's a shitty card. So you want to draw something cool. I drew the earth and a little stream, uh, the sun and a tree, and some sort of person. Could be my mom, could be anyone really. It's just a smile kind of person. Now comes the part that's going to impress your mom. Start using the color pencils that you just sharpened and color in the card. I'm taking the approach that my mom's going to like no matter what I do because I'm actually remembering a holiday that's about her. So I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time worrying about staying within the lines. After all, this is your mom you're talking about. She's going to love you no matter what. Hmm. You can really see the river taking shape now. One of the important things about the card is coloring it all in. That way the card looks finished. Even if it doesn't take you more than three seconds, that way your mom can't say, you're a lazy piece of shit because you didn't even finish the card. Because if everything's colored in, no matter how shittily it's colored in, it's actually done. The next part of the card is gonna be the inside of the card, or what I like to call the actual message part of the card. The important thing here is to not jump out and write some horrible stuff about how your childhood was whatever. What you want is just to send a nice like, hope you have a great day, thanks for being a wonderful mom. She'll recognize your penmanship immediately, and she'll like that it's handwritten, or she'll hate it. Next thing you want to do is color that area in as well, because the card isn't finished until it's all colored in. Now some of you might be wondering, what do we do with the other side of the card? Well that's easy. Mother's Day is all about love, so what you want to draw is a heart, and then another heart, and then another heart, and then just use your crayons and colored pencils to color that in as quickly as possible. You don't want to spend a whole lot of time on this card, because Mother's Day cards are actually a complete and total waste of time. That's why most people farm this stuff out to Hallmark and other companies, because they would rather pay money than actually waste their own time making a Mother's Day card. But that's not what you're about. You're about quality and caring and showing your mom that she's worth the time and effort and energy that that she put into raising you, and not a second more. Now on the back of the card, that's where you get to get a little creative because it doesn't really matter what you do on the back. The point is, you didn't leave a blank page. You colored it in. No matter how manic and disorganized and ridiculous it may look. Happy swirls. There. Now your card is done. Happy Mother's Day. The cost of this card was exactly one sheet of paper, and I have no idea how much joy she's going to get from it. This is one of those instances when the thought really counts more than the effort.